morning, boys and girls. This is Mrs. Tiny Tongo, and I am bringing you our Bible history lessons for this week. Our first one is 9a, Jesus ascends into heaven. You can look at Mark 16, verse 19, Luke 24, verses 50 to 53, Acts 1, verses 1 to 14, and 1 Corinthians 15, verses 3 to 7. Jesus ascends into heaven. After Jesus rose from the dead, he stayed on earth for 40 more days. During that time, he showed himself alive to his disciples many times. He ate with them, walked with them, and talked with them. Sometimes he met with one person, sometimes with a group of people, and at one time with more than 500 people at once. He did all this so his followers would have no doubt that he was alive and that he was their Savior. During this time, Jesus also continued teaching his disciples. He wanted them to clearly understand God's plan for salvation, the world from sin, for, for saving the world from sin, because soon they would teach other people how to be saved through him. He told them, don't leave Jerusalem. Wait there for the gift the Father promised, the one I told you about, for the Holy Spirit will be sent to you in a few days. At the end of 40 days, Jesus gathered his followers together for one last time. He met with them on the Mount of Olives near the town of Bethany. The disciples still thought that Jesus might set up his kingdom here on earth. So they asked him, Lord, is this the time when you're going to make Israel a free nation again? Jesus told his disciples not to concern themselves about such things. He said, my father will decide when that time comes. It is not for you to know. Jesus wanted his disciples to think only about the work that he had given them to do and told them, the Holy Spirit will come on you and give you power and strength. Then you will be my witnesses, men who will speak for me and tell people about me. You will begin right here in Jerusalem. Then you will talk about me in Judea and Samaria. Finally, you will witness about me to the farthest corners of the world. After Jesus said this, he lifted his hands and blessed the disciples. As he blessed them, an, an amazing thing happened. Jesus began rising into the air. The disciples saw him ascend higher and higher until a cloud hid him from their sight, and they could not see him anymore. As the disciples stood there staring up at the place where they had seen Jesus, two angels suddenly stood beside them. Men of Galilee, they said, why do you stand here? looking up into the sky. Jesus has gone up into heaven. One day you will, he will come back in the same way you saw him go into heaven. Then the disciples left the Mount of Olives and returned to Jerusalem full of joy. As they waited for the Holy Spirit to come to them, they spent much of their time in the temple, praising God and praying. <laughs> 